The three-faced Hecate. I have started the work, and a little key with these three little hearts found its way to me. As soon as I heard about our three-dimensional perception of reality, and you said that it is possible to see the fourth one, I asked her. Mm -hmm. Allow me to understand your fourth side. And immediately a silver key this time, with four little hearts, came my way. I haven't ultimately understood what her fourth side is. Now, since it's been almost a year that I'm trying to establish contact with her, I decided to make a figurine, a silver statue with a golden torch. I wonder if it's going to be contradictory. What if according to her algorithms of right granting, I do not have the right to do this? Can I continue nonetheless? Yes, you may continue. Actually, Hecate is a universal deity. Hecate holds within herself the power of all gods, meaning that she incorporates absolutely all of them within herself. Her main function, her main task is to tie all with everything. She didn't get her name such as the goddess of the crossroads, doors and the holder of keys for nothing. This means that she opens gates and connects everything together. Respectively, she supports those people who possess the same function of tying all with everything everything. And at the moment, none of your actions are contradicting her. You are searching, you respect all gods, and you aim to understand. She'll surely support you, because she does just the same. In fact, from a motherly point of view, she says, Mother said that in this world there is a place for everyone, each and every one has a place. And if you can't see a place for someone, it doesn't mean that such a place doesn't exist. All it means is that you're blind and I will teach you. I will teach you until you see my fourth side. My fourth side that shows that everything is needed, that everything is tied with everything else, and that in this world everything is necessary. She was able to reconcile the gods, she will easily deal with humans. It is a uniting force. If it wasn't for this force, we would have cut one another's throats a long time ago. She finds points of contact for us. She teaches us how to coexist. She says, if something is conceived this way, then it has a meaning. The fourth side is the meaning. You can see to the left, you can see to the right, you can see this moment, you can see the past, the present and the future, but now try to see the reason. And the fourth side is always hidden, always. In a Slavic tradition, there is also such a deity, but masculine, Svintuvit, maybe you've heard of it. He too had four sides, but was always portrayed three-faced. The first, second and the third faces were seen, but never the fourth, because it is always in the back, and that is this hidden secret meaning. In this symbolic way, using the images of gods, our ancestors expressed that a god can have a hidden meaning, and if you happen to understand Understand it, then it means that you understand that God. The traditional offerings to Hecate is the feeding of dogs on the 29th lunar day. They are her animals. So we would feed dogs on the 29th lunar day if we wanted to honor the goddess. And if after a year of work she gives you another assignment, because it will be an assignment, then you simply have to ask her and listen. Do you like this configuration or do you want to give me another assignment?